This is the Think Tank Photo My Second Brain Tablet. I did forget diary. The other day we took a look at Think Tank Photo's My Second Brain 13. It is a thin light bag for carrying your 13 inch MacBook Air or MacBook Pro along with a tablet, some headphones, and your cables and accessories. It keeps you nicely organized and keeps you going with a mobile office that is light and easy to carry. This is the tablet version of that bag, and it has an MSRP of $74.75. It is uh, designed to let you carry a tablet, a keyboard, uh, some headphones, some cables, a few accessories and adapters. It is for someone who has a truly truly light, small mobile office. So let's take a look at this bag and see if it might be a good option for you. As we saw with the 13 inch version of this bag, on the top you've got a thin, slightly padded handle that's great for grabbing and going. It's cross-stitched here, so there's no way this is coming off. It's like most of Think Tank Photos bags that are really well built, not overly built, but well, well built. You have the same strap actually that you get with the 13 inch, it's the same across the line. It has a nice padded area right here. It's adjustable. It has nice, strong, sturdy metal hardware. Love that when companies use metal hardware. It also has a plastic cross buckle right here. This is great if you want to hang a large pair of over-the-ear or on-the-ear headphones or a water bottle or something large like that. Obviously, this bag is so thin, it's not going to be good for something bulky like water bottles or headphones. I love the fact you can take the shoulder strap off and you don't have to use it. So, walking around the bag, here on the back you've got this Velcroed area and you can put some papers in here, an iPad mini, it's going to be a little bit too short I think for a full size iPad, but you do have room here for a tablet, and because it's Velcroed it won't fall out, but it does give you quick access if you want to grab it. Along the front, here you've got a zippered pocket and you've got a nice felt lined area here, great if you want to be putting your iPhone or your other phone, iPhone, in here, and you've got a mesh pocket right here with a little bit of elastic at the top, and metal hardware, nice, feels really solid when you zip and unzip it. Here on the front you've got this zipper that comes down along the top and the side, and when you open it up, you've got here an iPad mini pocket, here you've got a key loop, and you've got some organizational areas here two pens, a smaller pocket here, a pocket behind here, and you can put a few extra things in the main area here as well. Again, you don't want to overstuff a bag like this because it's designed to be thin and light. The main compartment, there's a zipper here and a zipper over here, and you can open it up to either side or open it up not fully because it only comes down this far. That's something I'm a little mixed on because if you could open it all the way, you could actually lay it out flat, but that's not what this is designed for, and I think I know why. And then inside, you've got a pocket here for items, another pocket here. Flipping it around, you've got a see-through window that zippers and another one down below it. The reason I suspect they have this area here so that you can open it up pretty wide, but you can't open up all the way, is that it prevents, if there are loose items in here, them from spilling out. So no matter what, you've always got something that's holding the loose items because there is space in here where you can put additional things. And then finally, here along the back, you've got a zipper. And when you open it up, you've got some nice padding and room for a full-size tablet. Obviously, if you use an iPad mini, you can put an iPad mini in here as well, but it will take a full-size iPad or a similarly sized tablet. This is specifically this line designed for people who use Apple products, but obviously it can be used with other products as well. It's very, very light. It's really well made. If you want to travel really light and you want something that I doesn't really look like a Merce, it actually looks like something uh, more serious than that, this is a really good option. You can carry it just with the handle, or you can put the shoulder strap on it. You can also organize yourself here and throw this into a larger bag if you want to do that. This is the Think Tank Photo My Second Brain Tablet. It has an MSRP of $74.75. This is Dan from Gear Diary. Thanks for watching, and please take a moment to leave a comment, to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and if you want to see the full write-up with additional pictures, please go over to GearDiary.com. Thanks very much.